Okay, guys, this is part, um, damn, nine now, I think. Uh, actually, uh, well, this is the continuation. Uh, the last video went on for about 43 minutes. So, just give me one second. I'm just going to double check something. <clears throat> This is part nine, sorry. My mistake. Okay. So let's just double check. Again, I don't want my uh, the sound. Well. The sound seems to be coming from my TV, etc. I don't know what I can do about that. I can't keep turning the sound down anymore because if I do, um, it's going to ruin the, you know, we won't be able to hear jack shit. Boys or girls? Girls locker room or boys locker room? I'm gonna go girls. Girls, of course. Girls. Ooh la la. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. <laughs> Alright, so we're going for a swim, apparently. In that last video, it took 43 minutes. I didn't mean for the playthrough to go on that part of that video for that long. Ooh, what's this? It's a Where sock. Where does that other sock go? Is that really the big mystery? We're looking for a Those sock. Those are some musty ass old shirts. Yuck. What's this? Brooke's locker. Looks like Brooke wants to go to the drive-in with Warren. What? Ah. That looks really old school, don't it? That drive-thru? Like uh, 80s or 70s or some shit. Like, you know, olden day times, you know? So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. Wow, so she does selfies as well. She just chooses not to show them. How weird. It's unusual. What'd that say? Kate's locker. Damn. A bus ticket? Was she going to run away? Like Rachel Amber? Arcadia Bay bus lines. One Portland trip ticket. $18. December. No, Decca, whatever that is. Expires on December 31st, 2013. Wow. Okay. Found a new piece of evidence there. She was going to run away. Otters eat beavers. Okay, what's next? Was that it in there? She's taking a sweet ass time about the pool being heated, isn't she? Fuck. We've been all around here. Uh, again, I can't run in this room. More graffiti. This isn't a desperate cry for attention or anything. Oh, here we are. Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. The light. Where the hell would the light be? Uh, okay, I can run a bit now. <sighs> a light. What was that? Oh. Mirror, sub dispenser, what? Okay, so it ain't here, obviously. A light. I thought maybe it'd be in an office part, but I don't know. I'm just running around. I don't know, whoa. Okay, well it clearly ain't this way. So it must be on over back over this side. 
Come on, I want to get in the pool. <laughs> There has to be a control panel for the lights around here. All right, here we are. Yeah, I was right. It wasn't some kind of office. Wow, it looks nice. She changed quick, didn't she? Coffee. Draw. What's in the drawer? Yes, we get it. Otters. Uh. <laughs> Look at their faces. What the fuck is with that? No detail in the eye. That's a bit weird. Alright. Let's go. Push her in. Smack that. Wow, why has she got skinny as fuck, ain't she? Should have pushed her in. Time to do or dive, Max. Well, I turned the light on. What the fuck? Ain't it? Can't I get in the pool? Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Feels like a hot tub. And with my cash dash, I'm queen of the world. Bow. Tell me you're not going to stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie. Okay, you asked for it. <laughs> Why look, an otter in my water. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> you are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> watch out you don't get chlorine in your eye. I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's Revenge. Cheater. Yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out why for Kate's sake. She didn't deserve to die. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. <laughs> You're becoming like this force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. What if I had all thanks to you? Hmm. Ah. Uh, what if I had? Thank God. But what if I had? What if you and Kate would both be dead? So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since without me you would have never discovered your power, right? Yeah. Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? And I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. <laughs> Warren is nice. Uh, you're a bro killer. Oh, gross. I'm gonna go you're a bro killer. Okay. You're the bro killer. <laughs> Tats and tood. You did not just say that. Plus, I am not down with these Arcadia Bay hillbillies. I don't blame you. Anyway, we have bigger fish to fry, right? No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're gonna make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's jet. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out.
I'm surprised nobody noticed that the fucking lights were on and shit. Gross. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Hi. Oh shit. Fuck that. Move, Max. Don't waste your power on getting busted. All right, let's get out of it then. Make sure you cover the whole perimeter. Are you shitting me? He said hide. So I... Okay. Dude, hide. Like when we were kids. I could use my power, or just look for a hiding spot. Okay. Like both. Where are they? Whoa, whoa. Hello? Right, when he comes in, I'm gonna go the other way then. Fuck it. Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. That was Madison. I heard something over here. Alright, let's go. Move, move, move. Who's here? I got I got a flashlight and a stick. Hey! Shit. I'll rewind. Flashlight and a stick. Alright, come on. I think we're safe now. In theory, anyway. A flashlight and a stick. Fuck's sake. <laughs> okay, do I go round and... Right now, do we get out? All right, I think we've done it. Oh, you can't so get the shit out of me. Whew. All right, we made it. Let's get the fuck out of here. Wait, turn around. They're coming. Fuck's sake. Oh, this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? <laughs> okay. Into the car. <laughs> Get in. Lucky she didn't forget her keys or some shit. Dodgy staying there with him, fucking looking around, snooping. That was the chlorine on us, you know what I mean? He's that kind of a fucking overprotective freak style fucking detective, do you know what I mean? Security guard. Who takes his job way too fucking seriously. Well, you know, compared to what it is. You know what I mean? He ain't a, a, a sheriff or whatever. a high school sleepover. <laughs> I 
Do I get up or take a selfie? Always remember this moment. Wow, even after I just walked in. Photo bomb! Photo hog. <laughs> it feels like a different world from yesterday. We left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. If I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. I wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. No, you don't. You're suspended, criminal. Oh, yeah, that's right. Nobody's suspended my homework. If I don't turn it in, the school will contact my folks again. And Max gets in more trouble. All right, let's get up. And start the day off. She's still got that money that we stole from the school as well, so. Okay, I need to get dressed now. Uh. Oh God, Warren sent me a fucking message. <sighs> a long ass one, probably. Um. Glad to see you didn't blow up Blackwell last night. Almost glad. Oh shit, if he know, if there's reports of that money being stolen, he know that we were there. Shit, I hope we don't say fuck all. Uh, by the way, uh, the drive-in actually popular, so I'm buying the tickets now. I'll let you take care of the popcorn. In other words, you can't back out now. <laughs> Alright. Alright, no more messages. That's good. Open the drawer, what's this? I don't think I'll be moshing today. Whoa, the rock t shirts. What's it say there? Poppy's gone. Ah, oh, damn, that's cold. Look. She. Oh, different stages of her life. Her dad probably did that up until the last bit. Poppy's gone. That's sad, man. Alright. Maybe I should have hidden the closet. No way would I have been suspended. I looked in. The, how do I get dressed here? Where's my clothes? Wow, sir. That was my 10th birthday. I didn't know Chloe kept this stuff. Don't look 10. They look older than that. Shit. Alright, whatever. Um. Laptop. Oh, here we are. Clothes. Get dressed. Ugh. Still reeks like a chlorine factory. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They reek of a chlorine. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. And that Madison guy will um will notice that or smell that, I'm sure. Okay. Time for some Chloe cosplay. <laughs> Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. <laughs> I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. What? Okay, so kiss Chloe, don't kiss Chloe. All right, we've got some lesbian action, finally. <laughs> um, well, fuck it, we're going to kiss her. Damn, <laughs> you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell him he doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> unless he's into girl-on-girl -girl action. You're such a dork. <laughs> go and go action. Oh man. 
man, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. All right, let's get dressed. Oh, man. How does she look in this shit? Looking oh, sick, Oh, God. Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, shaka bra. Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. Wake and bake I first. I the <laughs> Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Uh, okay. So we have to go downstairs. Right, let me just double check this video because I don't oh want to go in 40 God. minutes like it did last that time. So amazing. It's like when we were kids. 21 minutes. We've got about another 10 minutes max, maybe 35 minutes, but I'm, I ain't going on beyond that. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh, I, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Uh, pancakes, eggs, and bacon. Uh, let's get some pancakes, man. Shit. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William. And he loved them. I remember. We would race each other to grab them from a stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Eggs and milk? No problem. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. I assume the eggs and milk were in the fridge. But okay. Maybe I'm the freak. Oh, here's the milk. <laughs> I left it on the table. Now okay. for the mother's milk. Newspaper, bottle. Where the fuck are the eggs in? Still can't go in there, hold on. Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. Uh looking for eggs. Where the hell would the eggs be? That's a bottle, newspaper. <laughs> I'm gonna be looking in the most stupidest places for eggs. Oh, jeez, can you help me get this bird out of here? I just don't know. Where the hell are the eggs? Weird. That's why I went to the fridge instantaneously, like... Ah, oh, here we go. They're in a grocery bag. Okay. Yeah. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but we are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. Is Rachel okay? Rachel in trouble? Was Rachel mad at Chloe? Hmm, that's a good point. Was she mad at Chloe? Is there any reason that Rachel might be mad at Chloe and left without her? Chloe could piss everybody off but her. They were almost joined at the head. Reminded me of you and Chloe. But Rachel wasn't as grounded as you. I'm grounded? Since when? Maybe that's why Chloe likes Rachel so much. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Maybe or no way. Sounds like you she is partly trying to compare herself to her over time, I think. Hmm. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. 
Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what? A century old? <laughs> <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. Uh, the lesson, if anything, there is life goes by real, real quick. One minute I'm 18, then I'm 19, then I'm 20, 22, 23, and bang, I'm 28 right now, and life just, you know, it, it goes so, so far. So, you know, be warned about that shit. Hmm. Plant? What? I guess nobody waters the plant here. I drown mine, apparently. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. All right. Man, I wish I had some fucking pancakes. <laughs> Okay, I'll get up now or I've eaten shit. I can't move. What the hell? I can't do shit. Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive headline. Flash flash snow and freak eclipse apocalypse soon. Hmm. Seeing you again. Oh, here we go. Ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. Damn, it's sad. He had his car out right after this and... And... I know, Joyce. Oh, he died in a car crash? I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Here she comes. <laughs> Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please, it's too early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Oh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me, I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. <laughs> now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. All right, I have to go and investigate. I do need to get into David's computer. He's gotta be hiding shit. Okay. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Oh God. More clues, okay. Ooh, it's a wedding photo. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Sweet 18th, Chloe, I'm happy. 18th today, thanks, blah, blah, blah. I love stepdad. <laughs> Arcadia Bay. Greetings from Arcadia Bay. What, a fucking generic postcard, really? Nothing to see here. Hmm. Book. I search in a book. Looks like David has read this a lot. Coming back know? home, a veteran's guide. Damn. He is an ex-veteran, so... 
Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Video message from Mum Dad 2007. Alright, let's try that. Oh, okay. The date. Nope. Family. Stepdad. Magic 8 Ball says no. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, shit balls. Alright. Let's look for another password then. Play. No, I don't think it'll be that. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. It was not having you in the diner. What? Nice to know the gentleman still exists. Love to talk to you soon. By the way, name is Joyce if you forgot. <laughs> that might be a useful password. Two Wells Diner receipt. Eggs toast. What? Come see us again. Your server, Joyce. <laughs> My God. All right, let's check her uh, again. Right, this date. All right, we got in. Cool. Max the hacker strikes again. Whoa! Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Hmm. Rachel has been cutting classes all week, question mark. Frank and Rachel meet once again. Rachel avoids her dormitory, followed Rachel to Lighthouse. Okay, so Rachel went to that dodgy lighthouse. Hmm. Rachel Amber, 18, was picked up at Blackwell Academy for possession of a controlled substance. Drugs, this was reported by Deadwood Madison, head of security, blah, blah, blah details I better tell Chloe about this now wait shit can I there was other pages weren't there whoa spoiler alert instead of stalking Kate David could have helped her Kate M um, follows the same path every class of her Kate and Dana W talking about supplies for the vortex party uh, drugs question mark watch Kate with her church group she knows her Bible Kate stays in the bathroom Longer than any other student. Question mark. Drugs. Saw Kate helping Jefferson after class. Don't trust grown men with goatees. <laughs> My God. Kate has kept to herself since the Vortex Club party. Not even church. Question mark. Drugs again. Tried to talk to Kate about the party and she got upset and ran off. Guilty. Ah, so he's trying to investigate. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Max Caulfield. Shit, he's even looking at me. Fucking hell. What a freak. So he tried to question um, Kate about the party. And that's when she got upset. And he was hassling her kind of thing. In his investigation. So that makes sense in a way. That she was upset. And here's the dickhead now. Nice breakfast. David, you you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber house? Oh, wow. Costume? You know more about her than me. Must be nice to be suspended and have some free time off Blackwell. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. <laughs> Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. You used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? <laughs> Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? 
Side with David, side with Chloe. Ah, side with Chloe. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this Yep, he likes disturbing. children. I do not <laughs> have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, <laughs> you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? <laughs> oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day, Chloe. For once, just please shut up. <laughs> I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Well, we showed him, didn't we? Okay, now that caused some chaos. Um, shit. So he's looking very suspicious right now at this point. We're on 36 minutes, guys. I'm gonna have to close this one off. Um, and I will see you in the next video, whichever part that may be. God, I'm forgetting myself. Uh, like, share, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. The uh, story's getting better and better as it goes along. The plot's thickening, uh, twisting it. It's looking more and more that Madison's highly involved on the aspect of he might be, like, just gen doing a general investigation. But on the other hand, you know, it doesn't look too good. Him having pictures and harassing multiple people. Like, it's it's weird. It's odd, even harassing me. I don't know, whatever, or my, not me, but my character. <laughs> All right, I'll see you next time.